guys. Welcome to Tutor Sisters channel. Please subscribe to our channel to help us grow. For today's video, we are going to talk about the literal comprehension, interpretation, critical thinking and assimilation of the text. The Great Answer, written by an American journalist, playwright, editor and writer, Fulton Oxler. So now, let us all get into the literal comprehension of the text. During the Second World War, Gestapo, the secret German police were looking for the refugees to arrest and burn them alive. Many refugees were lodged in the boarding houses not so far from the Spanish border. Among them was a young mother and her little four-year-old daughter. In such a despair situation and fear of being killed, the mother's idea was to get into Spain, board a ship and safely get to America. However, her endeavors were failing due to the stubbornness of the Spanish guards and the rumors of the Nazis' arrival. The mother prayed to the God to save her and her young daughter. She met a man on the next day who was the leader of the refugees. With a ray of hope, the woman followed him. When the town was all asleep, she followed him to the trails of mountains to get down to the Spain frontier. She was welcomed by a group of refugees. The exhausted group helped the woman to carry her child to turn by turn in the sight of freedom. As they toiled higher, groan of exhaustion raised. The oldest man was lying helpless, but the leader was there standing stern and compassionate when he said that they hadn't died yet. The three old men lost their hopes. Still, the leader made them toil harder with the last drop of energy they had. As a result, they got new energy and by the next morning, they crossed the Spanish border. They were there to face the world of freedom with new strength and zeal in their lives. It was the great answer for the riddle of life. Now, talking about the interpretation, the text seems to be trying to tell us that the selfless service to the needy people is very important. It also emphasizes on the fact that we should act courageously even in tough situations. The supreme power of God is there to give us energy to face any difficult situation if we help others in need. Moreover, the story might be trying to tell us that our life is full of struggle and mystery and only those who can work hard can survive as supported by the law of survival of the fittest. In other words, success is a reward to those who are never tired of working hard and striving towards life goals. Now, talking about the critical thinking of the text. The story is a treasure trove of lifelong lessons and the answer to the mysterious riddle of life. Although this story gives great lessons, there are some ideas that I find doubtable. Are gods really out there as the story talks about? Do they influence our lives as per the deeds we do for the greater good? Isn't it absurd to venture such a dangerous journey just by trusting God? Moreover, in this selfish and individualistic world, do people really strive hard to save others instead of saving oneself? In the story, was the woman expecting the arrival of the same man? If not, how can she trust him so easily during such tough circumstances? How can the old man who is even unable to say a word or walk himself carry the child while he was climbing up? Besides these facts, the story has significantly presented a picture of what struggles can show up in the life we live. Also, it prioritizes the essence of selflessness, courage, and patience, which are keys to success. Now, talking about the assimilation, after going through the text, I got the insight that we should never give up on anything. There are so many opportunities waiting for us, and there are so many things that are yet to be explored. Thus, we should have faith on ourselves, which helps us to remain stable and consistent regarding our efforts leading a successful life. Also, teamwork is always good, and it helps us to grow and achieve whatever we value the most. Moreover, the text taught me not to escape from difficult situations and challenges, but overcome them through courage for the ultimate success. Thank you. If you liked this video, please share it with your friends. 
Make sure you hit the like button and subscribe to this channel for more videos like this.